Hey Gaylords, I'm doing another video and this time we are on coastline and this is the penthouse site. So for this we're going to bring Valkyrie, Mute, Mira, Frost, and then whoever else. Echo if we can, but I'm going Valkyrie so it'll have to be Cam or someone else that goes Echo. Um... Okay, so this is what we're going to do. Reinforcements, we got 10. 1, 2, 3. Then we go 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. We can put our 10th here if we want, or there. Um, or what's probably a better idea putting our tenth right here because we're gonna have somebody right here so then they can't get wall banged um so Hayden as Mira has a secondary shotgun so this is what he's gonna do shotgun the ground like that and make it don't destroy these beams so that they can't like go through like that but you know I already did on accident so um, this way, like if we have someone in here and they drop in there and we have a chance to, we can see their feet and they can't see us. Make sure you do it at the very bottom. You don't want to like go this high up. Do it just straight at the bottom so that we can uh, only see their feet and then wall bang them. And it's going to be pretty hard for them to see us unless they go prone. See, you can't see anything. You'd have to go prone. But if you're prone here, you know kind of hard to whatever also if we brought smoke as our last guy we could smoke this wall and it would go between both of them or we could smoke in there and you would have an angle from here because smokes are a lot easier to throw than c4 okay so that's that we have been having hayden put this but ever since he did on that wall it's not been as good, so go back to this wall, Hayden, as your Mira. I would do a crouch height one, so it would look like this. And then if you see someone, you stand up, you hit them there too. Um, your second Mira, you can put anywhere if you wanted to put it on this one have both mirrors so they have to guess you can do that you could put it right here to watch this area um but if you do that this one you might get it might get twitch drone and you'll be in trouble but um echo can sit here and this is exact head height i'll show you so that's the bullet and it's pretty much lined straight up with my head and he has an ACOG so whoever's echo could be right there too we don't have to have anybody in room since we've got this um, I would shotgun this hatch in case they're coming from below then Hayden you can drop and kill them you can drop here and kill them anyways so then the walls that we need to mute would be this back wall. So that's going to take two mutes, a third mute back there, and a fourth one right here. If, if you don't want to do this one, we can mute this room. You can put it like right here if you want. And that way they, it's going to be hard for them to drone this guy out. Um, but yeah. So I'll show you where I'm going to put my Valkyrie cameras. First one will go right here. The second one is going to go in here, just straight up top of that. And the third one, I'm going to go like this when the round starts I won't get detected and then I can put that back up but uh that camera is pretty hard to see 
it's right there but if I can get it even more on here like right there it's pretty hard to see um, so yeah then I would barricade this back up so now let's check these cameras we've got this balcony which is this window and that window we've got this room with and also this hallway where they always push at the end so we know when they're where they're coming from and then we got this hallway and this camera is pretty it's kind of straight in like the open but nobody's going to see that especially cuz it's an indented wall so if they're coming from here you can't even see it if you're coming from here you can't see it either until you get to right here and you're not looking up there so they'd have to be running this way and it's still hard to see because it's kind of a bunch of crap over there um, and so yeah then TJ is going frost I would definitely put a frost trap here um, what you could do is put a frost trap in here I don't know if they're gonna see it I wouldn't put barbed wire on it but um, you could put it in here because a lot of people like to drop here and then come right here so that could be a easy trap so that's two you could put your third one in here like there or there or wherever you want you could put a it like right here or right here too so that if they enter and they're running around to try to kill you there it's they might get trapped in there um okay so Hayden and Echo or Mew or Hayden and uh, Echo or Hayden and smoke or whoever in that room if we need the smoke to be in the other room then they can be frost right here TJ you got the cameras out there and you can just watch this door stay safe then watch this um, me and Connor are going to be roaming and Connor you're gonna control this side so you're mute you're gonna control this whole side as much as you can and then I'm going to control this side but um so if we wanted you just have to talk to our fifth if you want to have Cameron go mute mute all of these walls and you can go lesion then and as lesion you can pretty much anchor roam kinda where you just put like a whatever a lesion mine here a lesion mine in here and you can control that pretty well so you just have to help out whoever's mute but then you can control this backside we've both got to control this and then I am going to control over here and there's actually a pretty good spot how you can see through this tiny little hole and I can stand up and shoot them on that balcony and then I need to protect this backside. So if you do go lesion, put a lesion mine right here. And then we can help TJ on the back and Connor on the back, or Hayden on the back. And then if I get in trouble, I can just drop like this and go back around, go up the stairs. Um, and Connor can just go straight down the stairs. So we're gonna have two roamers and three anchors that's that one and the two in the room this spots really important you can't get shot through this so don't worry about it and just hold this angle just wait for them to peek you don't even have to peek like if you can sit here the entire game and make them run to you then and like give me and Connor a little bit of time to come help you then Connor can come up here and be ready for somebody to run in that door um, if we want to blow this and we have lesion or Hayden wants to shotgun it okay 
then echo as he's laying right here and watching that he can also lay right here and that is the window inside tj's room so that's what we can do and that's the setup for pet house